NASA has successfully crashed its DART spacecraft into an asteroid millions of miles from Earth. At 14,000 miles per hour, DART crashed into the space rock called Dimorphos, which is orbiting a bigger asteroid 7 million miles from Earth. NBC's Tom Costello covers space for us. Oh my goodness, Eight, yeah. seven, oh, six, wow. five, four. From science fiction to reality. And we have and impact. We have <laughs> this morning, NASA is hailing its history-making test of a planetary defense system with its DART spacecraft in time-lapse traveling at 14,000 miles per hour, slamming into a harmless asteroid named Dimorphos, orbiting a larger asteroid called Didymus, 7 million miles from Earth. NASA says the impact was right on target. As we hit, like, the last two minutes where we could no longer command the spacecraft and you knew we were on the trajectory and you knew that we were not going to do anything to change it. It was just joy. These stunning images of Dimorphos captured in vivid detail by DART's cameras moments before collision. Compared to other things that we've seen, that moon looked egg-shaped with a bunch of boulders clearly on the top. It'll take a month or maybe more before NASA can analyze all of the data from telescopes on Earth and in space to tell if DART successfully gave Dimorphos a bit of a nudge. A critical test if NASA hopes to use the same technology to one day deflect and divert a mega asteroid from hitting Earth. A nightmare scenario that's played out on Hollywood hits like the blockbuster Don't Look Up. You know how many the world is ending meetings we've had over the last two years? Drought, famine. Oh, the ozone is so boring. Scientists say Dimorphos poses no threat to Earth. NASA Chief Bill Nelson says the agency is now ramping up its ability to detect asteroids of any size. Right now, are there any asteroids that are in any way threatening Earth? We don't see any. But we can only uh, look for ones that are about 350 feet or so. Uh, we want to get to where we can even uh, find any asteroid out there. Technology is so amazing. Right. The DART team says it will be months before we know if the asteroid's tra trajectory has changed. But they are excited that this part of the mission appears to have gone off without a hitch.